myself yakub raghavan and my project teammates are sanmo priyan albert santosh raj and satish kumar our project is design and performance analysis of customized frequency divider using past and sister logic in 45 nanometer technology we have been guided by mr s mohammad sulaiman assistant professor department of ece miltech frequency divider is act as a generator that means takes an input signal of frequency and generate output as a frequency that is a multiple reference of frequencies it is implemented in both analog and digital frequency divider is built using a number of flip flops they are highly used in many applications such as fpga circuits the circuit each needs a different frequencies for that we design our frequency divider with set values our idea is to reduce the number of transistor in the frequency divider circuit so that we design every component in past transistor logic and in our design xor gate is used to set the required frequency values then t flip flop is used to make the positive edge trigger output under the voltage supply of 1.2 volt then various parameters such as power delay and skew rate are calculated to analyze its performance in 45 nanometer technology of cadence 2 in our proposed system certain necessary frequency passes to various digital circuit with existing system using a equal frequency divider method now on as key design operate with a different kind of frequencies that has provided by customized frequency generator to save the power and power is calculated using cadence switches or tool 45 nanometer technology and will be designed and the simulation wave is obtained now we move into our cadence tool now we open our cadence which is in that file and open project 21 our schematic will be appeared in the window as a frequency divider consists of input clock and supply voltage 1.2 while xor and t flip flop consist of clock pulses to trigger the circuit and then frequency divider is connected with the xor gate and t flip flop now we are going to run our schematic for that adl the adl window will be appear analyze choose and the stop time is given as 60 nanosecond to our schematic and then by clicking okay then output is plot to be plotted for that to select our design so first clicking our input 1 clock pulse and then our frequency divider output and then by clicking xor gate input and clock pulse and output of xor the output is fed to t flip flop clicking a clock only the t flip flop output is click then now we are going to run our simulation before that save all the plotted points then save all 
to get a power and delay and signal so by clicking all and save as system info then I'll give apply and ok now we are going to run our simulation simulation at least run So this is our obtained graph. So now we'll split it off. So first is an uh, input and then it is an a uh, frequency generated output, then XR, then XR clock pulse, then XR out and T clock and there will be a final output. Then we are going to calculate power for that clean an icon classic in that browser there will be a window appear in that trans before that by clicking your waves then the power we can append the power by simulation to get into the values for that we need to calculate the power so for that tool calculator in that we can be shown up the power 5.8 to 5 power minus 6 which will be lesser than our existing system then we are going to calculate the delay of our circuit so by clicking the before deleting the previous calculation and then now clicking the group delay then going to our simulation page clicking the waves we can obtain a delay also it's 0. 0 0.29.96 c per minus uh, which is also will be less to our existing system so will we conclude that our past transistor logic is better than the CMOS logic so we finally obtained the low power of frequency divider circuit thank you